So let's get straight into it, guys. What you're looking at here, if you Google Wiki link tree, you find this right here. Um, pretty much best way to get all our stuff free. So Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, um, TikTok, Spotify, everything. All our stuff is here, our socials. If you could follow along and share it with your mates, that'd be awesome. Um, oh, give me a sec. Mentioned to you guys I've been sick, I think, ever since last week. So still struggling for that. It should be all right. All right, let's continue. Um, at Discord, it was 300 people at the start of this NRL season. We're into round 15, and we are on 2,000, almost 700 now. So our aim is to hit 5,000 by the NRL by the end of the NRL season, um, and a couple more rounds like last one, we'll, we'll definitely crack that. Um, to go into it, guys, so the podcast that I'm doing right now, it'll be on YouTube and Spotify. It'll all be here in these links over here. Um, this article, the first one, help you help you use the try score odds comparison tool, the OCT. I wrote that a year ago. I probably need to write another one, to be honest. But you can check it out here. Basically explains what model value is, what historical value is, and what market value is. Um, I'm going to do a really simple explanation again for you guys right here. But all it is, it's, it's looking at the best odds that we can find across all the bookies on our odds comparison tool. Um, it's not working perfectly at the moment, first thing on a Tuesday night, but tomorrow we've got sort of eight to 10 bookies working for first try score, last in time, and first try score, second half. So all we're doing with these three value numbers over here is red is bad, orange is okay, green is good. That's a simple way to look at it. Uh, and also the higher the number, the better. Um, so if you look here, Greg Marju is absolutely perfect when you look at it. So best odds, $2.45. We found that on 365. All model value is it's looking at um, what our model thinks the price should be a dollar 85 and comparing that to the best bookies odds which is two dollars 45 and you can see here it's well the best odds are way higher than our models odds the historical value same thing what is his career strike rate of all the games he's played how many of those has he scored a try in that's what any time try score historical is if you base the odds just on that it'd be about a dollar 89 dollar 90. And again, $2.45 is amazing compared to that. Um, and the last one, market value. All we're doing there is looking at the best odds, $2.45, and comparing that to the second best odds. So that's $2.37 right here. So it's not super complex stuff. All we're trying to show you is, hey, this stuff is highlighted yellow. We found you the best possible odds across the bookies that we've got on our tool over here. It'll look way nicer on a Wednesday, by the way, when all the bookies have their odds up. Anyways, compare that to different numbers like what our model thinks, what their career strike rate thinks, and the second best bookie. So if you can't find value in any of those three, it's very likely it's a pretty crap bet. Uh, and you can see that by like a lot of the guys on our Discord, obviously they're punting for fun, and I, well, I hope they're punting for fun, but a lot of the times they're just multiing um, like a lot of wingers. And with the wingers, you look here, there's no green. There's... Honestly, there's a lot of red, which is crap. Um, so anytime you do that, like for example, you know, you go uh Khan Pereira at a dollar eighty, uh with coats at two dollars and Traboy uh, Tom Turbo at two dollars ten or whatever, right? Every time you're getting bad odds and you're multiplying bad odds by bad odds by bad odds, and you make it horrible odds. So I'm not doing the bookies any favors here by talking you out of same game multis. But really, you want to look at the other end, look at model value, disregard the rookies, because our model doesn't do a good job at rookies. But you want to look at stuff like Greg Marju. Oh man, if if there wasn't a risk of getting banned, I would say that is by far the best bet of the week. Incredible play. Great matchup. He's on the Knights left. Great odds, $2.45 for a winger, when he it's way better than what our model thinks and what his career striker thinks. It's just an awesome bet.